Okay, I'm first. And VP, VP counter is off. Fabulous. Okay, let's take a look at this board. Attacks Torturer. Is there a village to go with it? Oh, there totally is. Wandering Winder and Torturer. So, yeah, that's a big freaking deal. There is no direct defense to that. Uh, but there is trashing. There's Masquerade, which does actively counter Torturer. There's also trashing in Steward and Bishop. Okay. So that's a thing. You got a village here with Wandering Winder, Draw, Torturer, Steward, Masquerade. Ironmonger is just amazing no matter what. On the first plan of matching, I do what I can. Um, plus buy? Do you have it? No. No plus buy. So that's, uh, that's a big deal. However, Horde can gain, so what you can do is make a golden deck, yeah? You can buy, uh, you can, it's a variant of a golden deck. Oh, Masquerade. Mmm. Well, it's, the point of the deck can still be to play a million bishops, because you can uh, draw your deck, have a lot of actions, and then, uh, have X hordes in play while trashing X golds with X bishops and then buy a single green card that you probably also trash to another bishop on that same turn. So that's pretty good. However, is it better than just Village Torturer? How, well, I mean, there's Masquerade, right? I mean, you have to open Masquerade because Masquerade is the strongest card in Dominion. What do you get with your Masquerade? Well, Wandering Winder, Ironmonger... Ooh, Ironmonger's gonna be better to open with. I'm thinking Ironmonger, Masquerade, open. Get Thin. Uh, Steward can help you get even thinner, but you don't want to be super, super thin because of Masquerade. So, uh, that makes Draw very important. Torture just has to be important. Only because of the text on the card, uh, the the three dollars or three dollars. Listen to me, the three cards. Well, I would rather open with an iron longer than opening with a wander. Open with a wandering winder. I'm getting a masquerade here. How to build this is going to be difficult, but village torturer is kind of a thing. I want to get all the good cards like all of them, and I think I want to delay on Bishop as long as possible, because number one, he doesn't get the trashing benefit until it's probably too late for him to use it, and number two, I don't know if I actually want to go for Bishops for points. It could just be faster to do Village Torture stuff. You got a Steward, which is my favorite card. I did not, which makes me slightly sad. Now, I think there's going to be a point in the very near future, like almost immediately, where I start buying Wandering Winders over Ironmongers. Oh, yes, I love drawing my Ironmonger dead. It's like my favo thing ever. So, uh, Silver, I think, might be better than Steward. I'm going to want at least one Silver, because, I mean, these cards cost money, and Silver is money, so I can use the money to buy the cards. On four, is it one more Ironmonger, or do I already get a Wandering Winder? <sighs> one more, one more Ironmonger, I think. One more. Trash, get a Haven, fine. Ooh, Haven's there for reliability, you can uh, do good stuff. Here, yeah, discard that biz. I was trying to think of some weird case where I would actually want to buy that, but, you know. Okay, trash whatever he passes me and buy a thing. Probably a torturer, since he still hasn't gotten a masquerade. Without masquerade, I feel very good about going for village torturer. And now Wandering Winders over Ironmongers for Sherzies. Sure 
Now, I, I want to be kind of careful about the order I play my actions, and at least once I get Village Torture up and running. They're going to be playing guitar here. I'm going to shut the door. Because what I don't want to happen is to, to play a torturer and then play a masquerade and then just have him pass me the curse that he chose to gain. So, yeah. And you're probably going to trash. Yep. Okay. Well, you're going to get thin. The faster I can get Village Torture up, the better. What I want now is more of all of these things. I can only get one per turn. Whatever, I don't even freaking care. Oh, yes, I want that. And yes, I want that. Trash whatever he passes me. Play Torturer. Uh, this is going pretty well. Um, expand? Do I get an expand here? I can expand estate into engine component. However, uh, like all the estates are in the trash already, right? So that's just, that's not nearly as sexy as it sounds. So wandering winder. That increases reliability, helps me find my action, skip over this garbage. And uh, I was lucky to have both of these Ironmongers act as villages. I really can't support a third terminal right now. So it's got to be Wandering Winder. Here, I don't even think I play this Masquerade. Mm, maybe I do. What did he do? He gained a curse from that torturer. Okay, fine. I need to figure out how thin your deck is. And trash the curse. You have five. If you get a torturer, I'm going to have to probably consider getting a steward. Yeah, because uh, masquerade trashing, I do not want to fall behind. Your deck is ten cards. Fine. Um, let's play this. That actually worked out really nicely. That was really fortunate. Hopefully this is a very difficult decision for him. Maybe he'll even pass me a silver. Fine. Um, torturer here? Yeah. Hopefully I'll be able to uh, get double torturer this turn. So I will be drawing a Wandering Winder here with my first Ironmonger. If I get tortured, I think I'm going to take the curse. There's a, there's a very high probability I draw my deck this turn, and I'll be able to masquerade him that curse. I also don't want to discard these coppers right before shuffling in the middle of my turn. That's super bad. So I will be taking the curse if he manages to get the Torturer in play. But that's not happening. Second Torturer... You, uh, you have more terminals than me and less villages, okay? But I, that's not to say that I don't think that was the right move. It's just... I'm just saying things. Uh, let's... Let's play Ironmonger next. Now, I need to play Masquerade first, if I'm going to play it at all, but I think I just want to play the two Torturers. And Wandering Winter. I need to... Um, oh, you can also uh, get hordes for gains. Uh, this is not your last action. I will just take this curse then. 
You can get Horde to gain golds and expand them into provinces. That's also a thing you can do. Expand might be kind of nice, I guess. I might pick one up shortly. Um, I'd like to be able to use this Ironmonger as a village, so what I want to do is draw it, see if I can get another action on top. Eh, didn't work out, whatevs. Um, let's play the Ironmonger next. Very good. So if I play the Masquerade, I have to do it first. So we'll do that. This Ironmonger is going to be sort of pointless. Now, uh, what do I do? Do I get an Expand? Expand seems kind of nice here. I don't pick up like a Horde. And then I don't really... Well, I do still need Economy, but... I can definitely support one more Terminal. Well, I can tentatively support one more terminal. He still has not gotten a Masquerade. Let's get an Expand here. If tortured once, I will take a Curse and play Masquerade. If tortured potentially more than once, uh, well, the first one's going to be a curse no matter what. If he plays a second Torturer, I think I'll discard to that one. Kind of depends. Wait, do you even have two Torturers? You do. I really don't want to gain another curse. And Haven will be nice. It might be nice to reserve extra villages in theory, even though I don't like have extra villages yet. I'm a little disappointed that he's still able to do this kind of stuff. Keep up with my curses. Yeah, but you have a steward. Okay. Well, then I don't I don't want to focus on torture. I think that's what this means. Focus on torture isn't going to swamp him. I think the the time for that has passed. That is your second horde. Okay. Doesn't matter because I'm playing torture next. Well, he's going to pass me a curse. I don't think there's anything I can do about it, but whatever. Uh, I still got actions, so we'll do it this way. I could play Haven. Mm, no, it's not smart. Don't do it. I 
don't think I'm getting any more village plays this turn. I think these iron mongers are going to whiff. That said, well, if I put this back, I can play the other one, then play the haven, not play the second torturer, but play the expand instead. Mm. That actually seems okay. Let's do that. Haven the Torturer, because I'm not playing it. And then expand, probably silver into horde, and then buy a thing. I think I want another village. And then uh, we'll I think we'll be ready to green at that point. He just has two hordes. So, uh, yeah, single curse here is okay. I'm, I'm actually considering just taking the last curse. I really don't want to discard here. Actually, you know what? Discarding two coppers does not matter. So yeah, we'll discard. Make him sweat it. Make him take the last curse. I guess with the horde, the two hordes, you can get your economy going. Province and two golds. Uh, yeah, we do it this way, so that that happens. Draw it. Now I can't draw just one, so whatever. Uh, play the Masquerade first, since I know I'll be drawing my deck this turn. Trash that. Ironmonger next. Get out of here. Okay. Okay. I can expand a copper into something else. And still buy province and get gold. Whatever that is needs to be three dollars. I think steward is best at this point. Now the nice thing is he doesn't have any expands, so he's still capped at one province per turn. He also still has some curses in his deck. I believe I don't have any, so uh, I also went. Well, I went first. Double province turns are not out of the question for me, because I have expand. I don't think I... Well, I mean, I'll get to, I might expand steward into second horde, maybe draw it. Um, then get like two golds and then expand gold. Okay, now he has an expand. Fine. Uh, what next? I want to draw the Masquerade first. Uh, Haven? Really tempting to Haven this guy, actually. But, uh, I don't see any need to. Let's just Haven a Copper. Masquerade first. Actually, it doesn't really matter the order anymore because the curses are gone. So I need to stop being concerned with that. In fact, I really need to look at Masquerade as fodder for Expand. That was misplayed. I shouldn't have done it that way. 
All the estates are in the trash. Well, we don't want copper. Uh, doesn't matter, I'm gonna draw it all. Discard. We can trigger the shuffle, yeah? Yeah. Okay. I have enough money to buy a province. I can expand steward into a six cost. I can give myself a clean shuffle by playing torture on top of that. What's the six cost? Probably or I could get a duchy. Or I could expand the torturer into province and buy a province. Ooh, I kind of like that. Okay, let's draw. Well, this is not great, but duchy here will be okay. If there was ever a turn that I'm okay stalling, it's this one. Discard gold. That means you expect to draw your deck this turn. single province for you. Fine. Uh, nice thing about my position is because of this duchy, you can't double province this turn because uh, I, I win. So I actually really like my position at this point. Now, I would really like to expand a gold into a province instead of a torture, and, uh, okay, bishop, that, that's a good move. I think that's a very good move from you. Uh, yeah, I'll expand masquerade over torture for sure. Uh, we're just going to play torture, so this doesn't matter. Uh, Ironmonger next. It's likely to be a village. I think I've got good action density still. This has to be Goko lag right here. Yes, please. Uh, discard two golds. I should be able to draw everything. Should I? Maybe I don't have that much draw left. Either way, I'm going to go ahead and play this Ironmonger real quick. Okay. Steward to draw here. Yeah? Um, or Masquerade to draw. Hmm. Single Province here is just fine for me. He didn't uh, score any points last turn. So, Masquerade, yeah. Because Steward's more flexible. Get out of here. Um, Haven next. Counting. Uh, I can expand Horde into Province. Seems pretty good. Better than expanding the steward. Uh, I'll have in this duchy, just in case I need to expand it later to end the game. It'll be nice to have it in my hand. But steward for cards here. Do I trigger this shuffle? Uh, other option, trash two coppers, expand horde into province. That's pretty aggressive. I don't even know if I'm leaving myself with enough economy to end the game. I'm relying on expand to end the game at that point. 
but I do have four provinces at that point. He still can't double. How many cards are in my discard? How bad is the shuffle that I want to trigger? When did I shuffle? Here, and discard two golds, discard province gold. So there are four cards in my discard. Three of them are gold. I'd really rather expand gold. I, I have to do this. Okay, now I can buy province, get a gold. I could mill a province. That's... That's very good, yeah, we gotta do that. Yeah, that puts me in a very strong position because he still only has... Um, two provinces, and I'll have four. Let's do it. Okay, four to two on provinces. This is slightly disheartening. Four to two on provinces, and I have a duchy. So he's going to have a really hard time ending the game on a win here. It's going to take bishop trash and gold, expand into province by duchy, or something crazy like that. It's possible, but, I mean, I like that play. Uh, you're ending it on a loss? <sighs> okay. Wow, I had a brief panic attack. <sighs> mm, okay. Save the log. <sighs> okay. Whoo! All right. All right, let's uh let's <sighs>